Hey gals and guys, I'm here at the Crofton Farmer's Market. I'm so excited. It's Thursday, April 8th. It's the preview to their market, which opens officially next week. Let me turn my radio down here. Um, but this is the media day. All the vendors are here. Um, it's really cool. And I'm going to go over here and see what we've got. I'm going to turn my camera around. I think you can see there. There's some of the, um, the tents of all the vendors. Looks like they've got a great spot, great location. So I'm gonna go on over and uh, see what we've got because this is the beginning of my no more grocery store journey, which I know there's gonna be some hiccups along the way. I know that there are things that I do have to go to the grocery store for that I mentioned in my blog, um, things like flour and toiletries and things like that. But for the vegetables and the meats, I am really working towards not going to the grocery store anymore. So I'm going to go over here and see what we've got and take some pics and maybe even get some video. So uh, we'll be right back. is uh, heritage breeds of pork. So in this case, it's Two Rock Pork out of uh, Mandy Rose Farms in Iowa. It's a family farm up there. It's actually three cousins, all who have farms together. Uh, it's all sustainable. It's not organic. Organic's a legal definition. It's fine. It makes good, good quality stuff, but we feel that he's sustainable is more of an issue. All the animals are no antibiotics. Uh, they are not fit monoculture, so they're not just eating grain. They're outside pasture, right. eating bugs and grasses and acorns and what have you. Yeah. Uh, it just gives it, the meat such a flavor. Mm -hmm. You know, you don't get that uniform blandness. To it, so, uh, we just have the one size. They're fourteen inch. Farms. At Calvary Farms is right outside of Rundle Mills, Maryland. Uh, we actually have chickens, we have ducks, we have honey, we have massive gardens that thing. We are, our, our goal is to be 100% sustainable. So we mainly eat season to season, and then we also bring all the surplus here to the market. So, yeah. Great, and what is it that you sell here at the market? Uh, right now, um, we just have our component, we have our cattle corn, we also operate a concession company. Um, starting next week, we'll be able to have our lot, different lettuce mixes, uh, arugula, spinach, and green onions. Great. We'll be able to offer salad bowls, and the cinnamon roast, the cinnamon honey roast with the pines will excellent.
it. It was great. I had a lot of fun. Got lots of great stuff. Thanks to all the vendors. And uh, as you can see from my little red nose, it's pretty cold outside. And, uh, but it was a great time. Ran into a good friend from the Master Gardening Program that I'm part of. And uh, got some good food. Talked to some great people. And I'm looking forward to coming back every week and getting lots of great stuff. So uh, this is all for now, garden gals and guys. Until next time, happy gardening.